Hello all, my name is Joshua Peters and today I will be introducing DBCE, a saliency method for medical deep learning through anatomically consistent freeform deformations. Deep learning has brought groundbreaking results to the field of medical image analysis. However, the interpretation of such black box methods remains difficult, preventing their broader use in healthcare applications. In this paper, we focus more specifically on the classification of Alzheimer's disease from 3D MRIs, where traditional gradient-based explainability methods are not reliable in providing clinically suitable interpretations. To alleviate this issue, we propose DBCE, a counterfactual explainability method. We seek to produce anatomically consistent deformations, which, when applied to a given input image, will reverse the deep neural network's prediction. We see in the figures below two MRI images of the brain that are very similar. However, the deep neural network predicts the right image as a healthy controlled patient, and the left, produced by DBCE, as an Alzheimer's disease patient. Whilst generative methods remain impractical for large 3D images, DBCE proposes to generate new images by parameterizing a freeform deformation that will be used to resample a given input image. To meet anatomical plausibility and have uniqueness of the solution to the optimization problem, we enforce constraints on the resulting deformation. For a given image, the resulting optimization problem is effectively solved using a gradient descent algorithm in less than a minute. Interestingly, DBCE only assumes the differentiability of a neural net and is thus architecturally agnostic. At the end of the optimization process, DBCE outputs the closest brain image that will reverse the prediction of the studied deep neural network. As we can see in this figure, deformations produced by DBCE are constantly producing an enlargement of the ventricles region and a shrinkage of hippocampal and temporal regions. To ease the interpretation of such counterfactual images, we derive comprehensive saliency maps based on the difference between the initial image and the delusive image generated by our method. To conclude, this paper introduces DBCE, a generation-based interpretability method based on smooth deformations of the input image, available in 3D and which does not require additional training data or the use of generative models. It highlights two new visualization techniques for this method that monitors the voxel changes in intensity between the original and counterfactual image, or the local energy of the deformation. Further, this paper illustrates that DBCE is a useful, repeatable, and robust interpretability method when compared to pre-existing saliency methods. Thank you all so very much for listening. I hope that you enjoy the rest of your conference and if you have any other questions, please do not hesitate to ask Leo or myself. Thank you for listening.